Did you get all of them? No. I dialed up this guy. Uh, his oh, name okay. is... Forget his name. <laughs> the guy who the Tom had Arnold. The guy. Tom Arnold look like he spent like twenty grand trying to uh, <laughs> look like Tom Arnold. I have it written down on like a little cheat sheet of yeah. stuff to do. It just says "call to Tom Arnold guy." <laughs> right. I don't have his name either. I didn't get through, but you gotta hear his phone machine. So let me dial oh, really? this up again. Okay. You can tell he takes okay. himself seriously. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Oh, he's there. Let's talk to him. Talk to him. He's yeah. There. Hello, Stephen. Yeah. Hi, this is Tommy and Rumble. We're calling from a radio station in Virginia. How you doing? Do you have time to speak to us on the radio for a couple of minutes? Yeah, I sure do. But uh, I've done a lot of these interviews. There's got to be some restrictions. What's that? Okay, restrictions are nothing demeaning to Tom, Roseanne, and myself, and nothing uh, sexually explicit. Sir, we live by that. Yeah, because uh, I've, I've had people ask me horrible questions on these interviews, and just uh, uh, like what? Oh, uh, like uh, one guy animated that I was uh, hot for Tom, and I hung up on him. You mean in a homosexual way? Yeah, yeah. How disgusting. You mean he was he was re insinuating you were one of them queers on <laughs> yeah. the phone? Oh, that, oh that's, that's terrible. That's horrible. And one, one guy asked me if I want to have sex with Roseanne. <laughs> oh, my oh, God. Oh, jeez. What's know, the so point of that? Yeah. What's the purpose of that question? What, what other weird stuff happens to you, you poor guy? Yes, and uh, one guy asked me if I weighed 300 pounds. You know, you know, it's just it's totally uncalled for. You know, stuff. it's stuff like that that gives disc jockeys a bad name. Right. You know what I mean? But, uh, and how much do you weigh, by the way? I weigh 240. Now I'm very solid. See, two uh, See? solid 240. How tall are you? Six four. Wow, well, that's See, a big. That that's sounds a, about right. Big sturdy guy. That's yeah. all. Big yeah. sturdy uh, guy. Yeah. Of course, we would never demean Roseanne on this show, Tom Arnold, you, or make any sexually explicit remarks. Okay, then I'm happy to talk to you. Well, right. thank you, Stephen. You sound like a, a very nice man. Uh, I try to be. All right. So, question number one: When's the last time you had sex with Tom and Roseanne? <laughs> We're just kidding. <laughs> Steven. Steven. <laughs> <laughs> you had to do it, didn't you? You couldn't resist. <laughs> that, we'll never talk to this guy again. <laughs> you <laughs> son of a... I've blown the Tom Arnold look-alike interview. <laughs> I'm really sorry. Man. Bastard, you... I am so Bastard. sorry. <laughs> oh, man. I, really, I, I apologize. Well, the hotline's sorry, ringing. Uh-oh. What? You know, when the first time I called, when I called the machine, yeah, he, he gave you know, a pager number, and I gave him our hotline number on the pager number. So the I pager? think he's calling us back. I don't think he knows it was us who oh. paged him. Okay, wait a minute. Shh. Oh, Chance shit. to be redeemed. Jeez. He's on the hotline. Uh, Hello? Hello? Hey, uh, hi, Steven. How are you doing? It's uh, Larry and Marvin calling you back. We paged you earlier. Uh-huh. <laughs> and uh, we were hoping we could do an interview with you. You sure can. Now, I just got off the phone with uh, some uh, disc jock in Virginia. Oh. They started asking me very disgusting questions. You wouldn't do that to me, would you? Uh, do, if you'd like to set some parameters before we do the yeah, interview. I, I would. I, nothing sexual. Okay. You know, he just asked me, this guy that just called asked if he wanted to have sex with Tom and Roseanne. Oh, no. Oh, you're kidding. And I wanted, you know, and that is not a gentlemanly question. Steven, that's just darn rude. Yeah, and, uh, it is. It's, it's horrible. It's very cowardly, too. Very. If you asked me that question, my face would be in a lot of trouble. Yeah. yeah. Well, uh, welcome to the program. Thank you, sir. Stephen, now you've spent uh, quite a bit of money to, to look like Tom Arnold. Yes, sir, I have. How, much, how much money have you spent? Uh, 20000 Now, uh, you must run into people on the street who actually think you're Tom Arnold. All the time. How do you react? Uh, I just tell them I'm not Tom. We have a big laugh. And they give them one of my cards that says, Tom Arnold, look alike, Stephen Radford, and listing all my film credits. Real mm -hmm. funny. A lot of radio yeah. interviews, too, huh? A lot of them, and most of them have been pretty good. But you've had a few good. problems here and there? I, I've had a few problems. You know, not everybody in this world is a gentleman. Well, we appreciate your time on Real the air. Boring. We have uh, one other member of the morning show who uh, wanted to ask you a question. P, come on in here. I don't want to ask, no, because this, this is just weird to me, okay? Come on in here. No, I'm not doing it. You had a question, now I go don't. ahead and ask it. My mother told me if you don't have something nice to say, you don't say anything, so forget it. <laughs> I'm not doing it. Okay, P. You know, if he doesn't want it, he doesn't have to. All right, Stephen, thank you very much for being on our program. Ask him if you ever blew Tom Arnold. I hope we were nice enough. Uh, well, what did that guy say? He said he was completely blown away with the fact that someone would spend that kind of money to look okay. like Tom Arnold. Yeah. Uh, hopefully we were nice yeah, enough. He went down. We don't want oh. to uh, offend you in any way, and we, we hope that... Uh, uh, I think I heard what the guy said, and he is not a gentleman. What did he say? I missed it. Pee-wee, come here. Hang up. You're an idiot. Hello? Hello? Hello?